Good morning, y'all. Good morning. And welcome back to Life with Lady J. Welcome to the channel. Um, I'm at work. So, I didn't vlog Monday, Tuesday, or yesterday because I'm still in pain. So I really ain't been doing nothing. But coming home, coming to work. Um, depending on how I feel, I might go to OBMC tonight. It is the bartender and one of the sisters of the um, motorcycle club birthday today. And they're having a little party, so... I might go there. If I do go and I don't feel good, I'm just going to drop the gifts off and then take my ass home. So, <clears throat> it is Thursday. So, happy Thursday to everybody. Um, that's frankly about it. Just checking in. Um, letting you not letting you guys know what's been going on with me. Um, I'll probably put today, tomorrow together in a video and put it up depending on how long it is. Mm. But other than that, that is it. I am sitting here in my car, get ready to change my shoes because I need some um, some grip on my feet. So maybe that'll release some of the pressure off my leg. But, how have you guys been? Let me know down in the comments. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Let me know something you guys might want to see. Um, what kind of content you guys want to see. You know, things of that nature. What kind of videos y'all like. Um, and then we'll go from there. So I got me some, I went to Walmart and I got me some, um, some shoes from Walmart. And they look kind of cute on my feet. I got the little design in the back they were ten dollars at walmart and then they got gray i think they got gray i got a tie-dye color a tie-dye pair because <clears throat> i got a tie-dye shirt to go with them um they have white and um i think that's it I think that's all the colors they get. Black tie-dye and white. But that is all. That is all. I hope you guys have a great day today. Have a blessed day. Stay safe. Stay masked up. Be precautious of everything that you do. Make sure you wash your hands. And I will probably come back to y'all hmm, probably around 12. It's 9 now. So, yeah, probably around 12. Until then. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. And happy Friday. Happy Friday, y'all. Happy Friday. It is another blessed day. Another day to thank God for waking you up this morning. 
another day to thank God for letting you see another day. Another day to thank God for putting air in your body to breathe. So, how are you guys doing this morning? Me, of course, I feel okay. I am, I took some pain pills, so I feel okay right now. Um, yeah, other than that, I'm just, of course, on my way to work. And um, that's it. That's it. I um I did go out last night but I didn't vlog it because it was somebody's birthday party and they had a stripper in there and I couldn't put that on camera so yeah um but I didn't stay long anyway so it wouldn't have been enough footage for me to vlog anyway because I only stayed for like an hour and um I was really in a lot of pain last night. But today I feel okay. Um, I have an eye appointment tomorrow. So we'll see how that goes. I'm trying to get me some contact. I was in high school. I'm just tired of wearing glasses. You know, it, it, it inhibits my ability to be able to wear sunglasses like I like to wear when the sun is out. So, I am going to see about getting contacts. And um, I've worn contacts before, not prescription-wise, but I've worn contacts before. So, I know how to put them in. I know how to take them out. I know how to clean them. I know how to do all of that. So, yeah. But, that's it. Just sitting here. Well, not sitting here. Just driving on my way to work um it's a little chilly this morning 61 degrees y'all it's getting cold it is getting close to fall uh, i don't know what you guys have and what's going on but yeah it's it's getting close to fall and yeah was something I wanted to talk to y'all about so I wanted to do start doing like conversations with Lena um just talking about you know a lot of the issues that we have going on in the world a lot of the issues that we have as far as us as women um when it comes down to either relationship, um, your personal self, or um, just anything. I'm thinking about turning that into a, I don't want to say a series because it might be, you know, a time or two where, you know, I'm not able to do a conversations with Lena, I mean with Lady, um, but those are some things I have coming in the works that I am trying to put in motion, and if that is something you guys would like, then just let me know down below in the comments, and um, that's something we can start, I think that'll be a good thing to have conversations with lady whether it be car chronicles or whatever you know just just to see how everyone's going doing out here you know just to feel like you have someone you can talk to and you know release some things and let go of some things and, you know so let me know down in the comments if y'all like something like that 
But again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like this video. Make sure y'all subscribe to Life with Lady J now. Make sure y'all subscribe. Um, I'm trying to get more and more vigilant with my videos and um, you know, put more content out. So, yeah, but I am getting ready to listen to my radio and get the work safe. Once I get the work, I'll come back and let you guys know that I have made it. And then maybe we can start the conversations with lady when I get to work. Until then. Okay, y'all. So, I am back. I have officially made it to work. Y'all see my curly hair? Hot. But, yeah. So, so yeah. I am officially at work. But, um... <clears throat> So, like I mentioned earlier, if y'all want to do the conversations with lady, then don't forget to leave me a comment down below in the description or comment section. How about that? Yeah. Make sure y'all leave me a comment. Let me know if y'all would like the conversations with lady series. I'm just trying to step out the box a little bit and think of some other things to do and, you know, some other content you guys might like. Y'all like my nails? I did these myself. I did these myself. So, yeah, other than that, that's it. I'm gonna go in here and um, get my day started and yeah that's it hopefully this day go by quick that way i can get out go home and lay down you know get off my leg but um so there is one topic that i wanted to bring up because someone had asked me before if i could give them some advice on marriage so if I could y'all probably don't know but I am married and I have been married for the last four years but I've been with my husband for almost 22 years so yeah um I always told him before I before we got married that I was only doing this one time I'm not getting married no more after this, if this don't work out. Um, but he wasn't ready. So it took him a long time, yes, of course, to get his stuff together and become the man that I needed and wanted him to be. And um, so I think when he got sick and a life changing moment happened for him is when he I guess had an epiphany of okay I have to stop and now let me let me say this let me say this we've been together for that long and we've been we've been together for that long like there wasn't no breakup in between there wasn't no cheating in between uh, anything like that. Like we've literally been together that long, but you, you, me as me personally, I have that sense of when somebody is not ready to do something, and I'm the type of person I'm not gonna force you, not gonna push you, not gonna beg you, not gonna kiss your ass, not gonna do none of that. So when you get ready, then you let me know. But um. I think after that life-changing moment he had is, I guess, when he realized that he should have married me a long time ago because 
I'm that person that's I'm when I when I call you when you're someone that I I love and care about and I call you my family whether you're a friend a really good friend of mine and we're close like sisters um I'm I'm down for you I ride for you I me I'm that loyal person and I've always been loyal to him and when he got sick nobody was there to take care of him but me no family no daughters no mother no nobody nobody came to his rescue but me and at the end of the day you realize who's really in your corner when you're down and out when you can't wipe your own ass and you have somebody that's that much down for you that'll do it for you no questions asked no hesitation no attitude no nothing that's when you realize that you've got that down ass bitch and that's me so we got married we're still together we you know so yeah that'll be a topic i'm gonna get more in detail and more in depth into the some into that excuse me y'all more in detail and more in depth into that topic right there um because i've had a lot of people ask me advice about marriage and everything so we're gonna take care of that and then you guys leave me some topics down below and let me know some of you guys' questions that you have if y'all need advice on anything whether it be relationship whether it be a relationship family wise friend wise uh significant otherwise or just in general you know just leave me some comments down below and we can start that's how we can start our series of conversations with lady so um I'm going in now and get my day started so it can hurry up and get over. And I will see you guys later on. Until then. Hey, y'all. So, welcome back to the channel. Um, I know it's kind of early. It's 4.30. I'm on my way home. I just, I just can't sit no more. I can't. I need to lay down. It's... Y'all y'all if you never had a sciatic nerve pulled baby when i tell you it's worse than labor pains listen your back feel like it's wide open every part of your leg is throbbing my toes are numb like i can't wait till wednesday to get whatever they need to get done done i just i can't take this anymore it's almost going on two weeks since it's been like this and i just can't do it no more i just can't do it so yeah um other than that i got chipotle to eat and I'm going to take me a pain pill or a muscle relaxer and I'm going to lay down and go to sleep because it's just this too much. I got on a, a brace, an uh, ankle brace, and that's not working. That's not even taking a bit of pressure off my foot. So, yeah. But other than that, um, I'm just on my way home. Like I said, tomorrow I have an eye appointment, so... I'll probably vlog that, but until next time, guys. Good morning, y'all. Well, good afternoon, my bad. Good afternoon. It is Sunday, and I am doing a seafood boil for me, my babe, my dad, and my stepmom. So we got scallops. We got shrimp, tiger shrimp, mussels, corn. We got lobster claws over there. Here we got sausage. Oh, it's also put potato in here too. So yeah, this is what my Sunday dinner is looking like. I added garlic, onion, some onion powder. I also added garlic powder. Um, shrimp 
seasoning and this Badia complete seasoning, Sazon complete. And that's all I put in there. So now I'm going to add some butter. I'm going to add some butter in here. And uh, a little water, aluminum foil. And in the oven it goes. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. And how are you? How's it going? How's it going? Happy Monday. And welcome back to the channel. Y'all, I got two days. Listen, <laughs> I know I come on here and I tell y'all every time that I'm in pain. But I don't think y'all really understand, so. So, that's it. Just pulled up at work. not doing anything else other than that i hope you guys had a great weekend i pretty much stayed in the bed the entire weekend i didn't do a lot i can't i can't do a lot so other than that i hope you guys have a great day um stay blessed stay safe stay masked up and until then i'll talk to you guys later Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, good morning. And welcome back to Life with Lady J. How you guys doing this morning? I hope you guys are well, y'all. My real nails. This is down to my real nails now. I'm finna wear contacts, y'all. I forgot to tell y'all. So, I've been wearing glasses since high school, okay? Now, mind you, I am 43, okay? 43, and I've been wearing glasses since high school. I'm now finna start wearing contacts in like eight days. I'll have my contacts. So, I'm very, very excited about that. Of course, y'all know I'm on my way to work, but I have a few stops to make. Before I get there, like to the post office, and then I need to find me some heels for our photo shoot tomorrow. I told y'all before I'm in a social club, so our anniversary is coming up, and we're doing a photo shoot tomorrow, no Thursday, for our anniversary pictures. So our anniversary is on the 24th. If you are in Georgia, and you want to come out and kick it with your girl, all you guys have to do is go to Blockburners Motorcycle Clubhouse, and I will put the link, put the address in this video to where it's going to be if you guys want to come out and celebrate with us. We, should, we will be having, I think, a bull because our theme is the Rodeo Redemption. So we're doing like a cowgirl, cowboy kind of vibe thing. So we will have a bull. We'll have a, um, I think, a, a lash girl selling lashes. Um, I think we'll have a cigar person there, a hookah girl. And um, the edibles. We'll have edibles. So y'all come on, come out and get lit with your girl. Have a good time with your girl. It's going to be a blast. I'm trying to tell y'all. But anywho. Yeah, I'm just on my way to work. Y'all, sorry for this glare. The sun is killing me. But I don't want all this shit in my camera. So, y'all got bit by a damn mosquito. Oh, this shit itch so bad. I'm trying not to scratch it. But it's so bad. So... I am um I go to the doctor tomorrow for my leg and I will let you guys know what the doctors say as far as what they have to do for my leg um 
Yeah, other than that, that's it. Other than that, that's it. So I'm just going to have you guys ride along with me. So I can get some content for you guys to the post office. And then I'm either going to Burlington. I'm probably going to look around Burlington first because it's 810 and they're the only Burlington and Ross are the only two stores that's really open right now. Well, open this early. So, yeah, I'm going to go in there and try to find me some um, shoes. I mean, I won't be walking around in them long, you know, but wherever we stand in, because we're wearing, wearing like ball gowns. This elegant picture, you know. So, the kitties are out getting ready to go to school. The school traffic, y'all, I just can't. I can't deal with it. It is too much. But I'm thinking that we're finna get ready to have a shutdown, y'all. Because now that the kids are in school, our kids are catching COVID. Some of the kids are passing away from COVID. And it's just too much. It's too much. Like, why? Why are these children in school? You know? Why are they in school? Like, why? I don't understand. Why are they in school? I know the parents... I know parents are like, oh my God, I'm so glad my kid is in school. But your kid come home with COVID and you don't know why. Or your kid comes home with something you just don't get it you know I don't know I thank God my kids are grown and out of school right now I hope they are being safe and not just out here chilling without a mask on I wear my mask at all times and I've been vaccinated but they still say that those who have been vaccinated can also still catch the virus. It just won't be as bad on them as those who are not vaccinated. So, yeah, I don't know, y'all. I don't know. I just, I don't see it. I just don't get it. I don't understand, like, why these kids are... But anyway, I hope you guys have a blessed and wonderful day today. I hope I seem a little bit more happy, a little bit more upbeat, uplifting, because for the past almost two weeks, I've been in like so much pain. I mean, I'm still in a little pain right now. It still hurts and it still bothers me, but not as bad, I guess, because, you know, I've been walking on it for so long that, I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to go to the next light and turn. I'll just go back down. It's this light right here make it no way so I um go down to the next light and come back come up come up the back way come on now car come 
Come on. You wait till the last minute to put your blinker on. I don't get it. I don't get it. Y'all folks wait till the last minute to put y'all blinker on. And you know you want to get over and turn. Why not just put your blinker on so you can get over? So the people behind me and behind you know you're about to turn, you know? Anyway. Listen, I had told y'all before that I wanted to do conversations with lady. I'm still going to implement that into my vlogs. Um, like I said, if y'all are interested, just leave a comment down below in the comment section, section and let me know exactly what kind of conversations you guys want to have. Because like I said... I've had people ask me about relationship advice and marriage advice and things like that. So, the first um, conversation with Lady is going to happen probably Thursday. Probably Thursday because I'm not sure what they're going to do to my leg tomorrow. Or if I'm going to be able to be up. If I'm going to be, you know, sore or anything. I don't know what's going to happen. So I don't want to start the conversation with Lady tomorrow. I'll rather do it on Thursday. That way I know I have, you know, some time to rest in the medication. Or whatever they're going to do, you know is over with so yeah the first ep well i ain't gonna say episode but the first um conversations with lady will probably start on thursday so i'm just driving in the school traffic y'all this is too much it's too much you know you you don't understand if you take your kid to school, then more power to you. When, you're, when your kids catch the school bus and they're all over the place and you're stuck behind them, things like that is just, it's too much. That's why I leave my house when I leave. Because I don't really want to get caught up in that. But sometimes I do. Sometimes I do. Sometimes I do get caught up in it. So... Other than that, y'all, I got this semi-truck in front of me, and I wish he would go ahead and do what he go do, because he is definitely in my way. Thank you. Y'all see that semi all in my way, driving two miles an hour, but... So I went to the post office as y'all seen. Now I am on my way to Burlington to try to find me some shoes. I don't have to be to work until 9. So, I have plenty of time to do what I need to do. If I don't find anything in Burlington, I'm probably going to go to Ross and try to find me some shoes for this um, photo shoot. Hopefully, I can find some in Burlington for the low low, little low low. And um, I want to find some shoes that I can wear more than once. You know, this dress, the dress that I bought, it'll be here tomorrow. I got it off Amazon. It was $39. Um, it's a, like a 
prom dress sorta. It's real, real long to the floor. It goes around the neck, but there are no sleeves. And it's mermaid, so I will be wearing my waist shaper. Yes, I will be wearing my waist shaper up under it. Um, but it's the type of dress that I can wear again if I'm like going out to a formal event or anything like that, black tie. I got the black dress already, so yeah. Yeah. People out here in, in Atlanta or in Georgia, period, think they got bumpers on their ass. Like, they can't be hit. Then you turn cross street and flip flops. What? You biggie dummy. But anyway. So we are on our way to Burlington. And see what we can find. I'm gonna take you guys in there with me and see what we can find, y'all. See what we can find. Come on. fucking brakes. Act like you don't have the brakes. Like, why you riding my ass and you ain't going nowhere? You riding my ass, ain't going nowhere. That just don't make sense. They, these people is crazy, y'all. So we are here. Burlington, Burlington. And I say people be in here early, y'all spending money. Early, girl, early. Okay. Oh, they, they store people. Mask on. Mask on. Let's go, y'all. All right, y'all. So I didn't get those shoes. I'm finna go in Ross real quick and see what they got. Yeah, I'm finna go in Ross and see what Ross got. But other than that, that's it, y'all. So we finna go in Ross right now. Shit, no, what he's doing. 
if Ross got some nice little cheap shoes. Because y'all really don't wear heels. Because my ankle doesn't allow it. But I will wear some wedges. But for this photo shoot, we have to have on heels because of the dresses we're in. So, yeah. So, once I get inside Ross, I'll come back. Hey, y'all. Okay, so I didn't find nothing in Ross. That's why I didn't come back to the camera. And then my leg started hurting. So, yeah. So, I'll see you guys again probably when I take my lunch break. I might going to go to TJ Maxx and try to find me some shoes. So, until then. Good morning, everybody. Good morning and happy Wednesday. Um, I'm not going into the office today. My team lead, my supervisor is going to work for me today. Well, I'm still going to work, but I'm going to work from home. She's going to go into the office for me today because I have a doctor's appointment for my leg at 12. So, it didn't make no sense for me to go all the way up there and turn around and have to come all the way back. So, But, I am on my way to Walmart right now and um, grab some things from Walmart and it's raining it is raining <clears throat> so yeah but other than that I'm going to take you guys into Walmart with me of course when I get there I'm going to record If I do forget to record, I am going to show you guys what I got. But other than that, I will see you guys when I get to Walmart. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, good morning. And welcome back to the channel. It's Life of Lady J. Um, it is Thursday and it's raining out, y'all. So please be careful. I'm currently not on my way to the office. I will be working from home until I have this procedure done. But I have to go out and get me something to eat because the medicine that they got me on for right now requires me to eat with food. So, and I can't wait to cook something. So I'm just going to go grab something to eat. Other than that, um, yeah, so I went to the doctor yesterday and she showed me a picture of the CT scan that they gave me while I was in the emergency room. And my L5, for any of you who are in the medical field and know the human anatomy, my L5, which is my lumbar 5, and um, my L5 is slightly off. And um, there's a narrow space in between. So which means either the muscle, the nerve in there has thinned away. And it's causing my bones to rub together. That's why I'm having this back problem. And it's actually affecting my nerve, the nerve in my leg. So, yeah. Um, I don't know. I don't know my supervisor, y'all. Anyway, I'm going to leave that alone. So, um, yeah. So, I'll be working from home until then. I have to wait for them to clear the MRI with my insurance and then they'll schedule me a date and time so I'm at home right now and she ain't really liking that you know but I can always quit and then if I quit I can do YouTube full time and y'all will get a lot more content a lot more videos but until
until that money started rolling in, I still have bills to pay. So, I'm currently looking for another job. So, if y'all know of some work from home jobs that's hiring, like right now, please leave it down in the in my uh, in the comment section for me. I would greatly appreciate that. So, we're gonna start conversations with lady probably today but it won't be car conversations it will be come on come on come on it's gonna be um in the house so conversations with lady will be held inside of my home via you know video so whatever questions you guys have or any advice that you guys is looking for please leave me some questions down in the comment section i'm going to post this to my community tab so when y'all see this tomorrow then we'll have conversations with lady day two on friday so that there that way y'all have y'all see this video and then leave me some comments and some I mean, some questions and whatever you guys need advice on down in the comment section this bus in front of me got a lot of fumes coming from me Ugh. had to turn off my eight my defrost because it's coming in through my car through the vent Oh, and it's bad. Ooh. But yeah, so I'm going to edit what I have right now. The videos that I have right now, I will be editing them today. Um, hopefully you guys will get this video this afternoon. Because <clears throat> that's, that's what I'm planning for. So when you guys receive this video... And you see me ask to leave questions down below. Just leave me. I'm going to post, put it in my community tab as well for y'all to leave me some questions. That way y'all will see it. But other than that, um, you guys have a great day. I'm going to run in this gas station real quick. And I will talk to y'all when I get back to the house. Until then.